Hey everyone, it's Megan. And Chrissy. And you can actually make this, so... Well, you know last time Miss Cabbage decided to make an inedible um, object, but today we're actually going to make something you can all make at home and yeah. actually consume. So my mom's going to show you how to make it, and you can actually make it, and it's edible, and you could eat it. It's FDA approved. Also ask your parents for doing this because it includes hot... Like, hot boiling. Like, hot boiling water. We also put this, um, our gar balls in one of our, one of Klein Lee's episodes, Jerry's Job, and we can put a little annotation at the bottom yep. if you want to go watch the episode. So, see you guys later! And finally, I can freaking talk, since my daughter Megan and her friend Christy had ruined my video with having a video saying it's actually edible. Anywho, let's get on with the video. Some things you'll need for this is agar agar powder, which you can buy an Asian market for $1.99. And next you need Gatorade um, or juice. And I pick blue because blue is for only cool people. It even says right there, cool blue. Next you'll need pure vegetable oil. If it's not pure, it's not gonna work. Last thing you'll need is this dropper thing, a measuring cup, and whatever this is. Now for this to be FDA approved, Megan, my daughter, says I have to wash my fingers because they have like crap in it or something. So I'm gonna wash my fingers in water. Yep, there you go. Now this part's not really that important, but you need it still. But you're gonna want to put the pure vegetable oil in this cup, around like one cup or so. But if you wanna be professional, you could have how much you want, but just get a cup and fill it up with vegetable oil. Once you fill it up, you stick it in the freezer for around 30 to 40 minutes. Wait, 30 to 40 minutes? Megan! What? You said it wasn't gonna take this long. Um, yeah, it's gonna take like 30 to 40 minutes in the freezer. Get Christy right now. Christy. What? Get over here. What, Megan? I have a question for you. Why do I have to put it in the freezer for 30 minutes? I don't know, Miss Cabbage. Why do you have to consume so much meat? Um, because I'll die. Well, the Ugga Barrels will die if you don't put it in the freezer for 30 to 40 minutes. <gasps> okay, fine. So now what are you? I stuck it in the freezer. Now I have to wait 30 minutes. Then you need to work on the other part, Mrs. Cabbage. What? To get the agar liquid ready. Yeah, Mom, there's two parts to it. Um, fine. And now you want to measure a half a teaspoon of the agar agar powder. Make sure it's half a teaspoon. Mine doesn't look like it, but it is. So now stick it in a bowl with your favorite juice or Gatorade. And I think the Gatorade is, I think put like a cup of it or something. Yeah. So I just put the powder in, and now you want to get your favorite juice or Gatorade of your choice in a Coca-Cola cup. If it's Pepsi, you know what comes next. If you watched my latest video, and you just pour a cup of that juice in, oh, oh yeah, and now you want to mix it. Now you want to put the saucepan with it on to the stove and mix it while it's on, I mean, underneath the fire. You mean on top the fire, Mom? Megan! Stop ruining my video! <clears throat> Anyways, like I was saying, continue until it boils. And now for a real life demonstration for all you. Ow! Ah! Anyways, for all of your human people out there watching this video. Now it's done boiling, so turn it off. And uh, now what do you do? You wait 20 minutes. Um, uh, I'm sorry. What did you say? I said you have to wait 20 minutes. Are you serious? I, I, I'm most serious. Okay, you know what? I'm done. I'm gonna kill myself. Mrs. Cabbage. I'm gonna jump off the set. Mom, don't. <gasps> it's the end. <gasps> sorry, guys. Mom, we paid good money to come on this set. It's your college fund money, honey, so I ain't losing anything. What? Don't worry, Megan, you can have some of my scholarships. Oh, good. What? 
What? I don't believe in scholarships. What do you mean you don't believe it? That makes um, sense. I don't believe in it. Just like how my Grammy doesn't believe in global warming. How do you not believe in global warming? Um, I don't know because I don't believe it. She doesn't. You can make your own decisions, Mrs. Cabbage. Um, uh, yeah, well, that's what I believe. Because she doesn't believe in it. Well, you're an idiot. Now that it's done, um, we gotta let it cool, which has already been cooling for a while. You just gotta wait 20 minutes for it to cool, and then you can go on to the next step. Okay, and now, um, I had it for cooling for a little bit, and I see a piece of hair in it. Christy! I didn't do it, Mrs. Cabbage. I don't have black hair. Or shall I say Megan? Um, I don't have black hair either, Mom. And I'm not even furry. I don't have any fur on me. Then I told you it's Christy. I told you I, I'm not- do I look black to you? Um, yeah, am I a stupid? You are black and white. You're colorblind. No, I'm not. We're all colorblind. I'm surprised you know that Gatorade's blue. Um, it said it was blue. No, let's let's just get on with it, okay? Let's just get this tutorial over with. <sighs> Once it's done boiling, put it in a heat-proof bowl, but I don't have a heat-proof bowl, so I'm just gonna be an idiot and stick it in the same bowl. Okay, so now I took out the oil. Um, and as you can see, it's cloudy and like frozen because I had it in there 4,000 hours! <sighs> Anyways, so once you're done with that, you're gonna leave it out just so that it's not like frozen like mine. Oh, and it can't be cloudy like this, so you gotta let it, like, you know, not look cloudy or it won't work. It's almost done. <sighs> Maybe if I put hot on it, it'll. You know what, maybe I'll warm it up in the microwave. Mom, don't do that, you'll be back to square one. Then you'll have to wait another 20 minutes again. Fine, oh look, it's already done. It's not cloudy anymore. So now you can go on to the next step. Now that it's cooled forever, I got it in this little dropper you're gonna want and you wanna drip it in there. And watch the magic happen. A bubble, a edible. You want to keep on making as many droplets as you want. It's actually making it bigger. Go down. Go down. Okay, as you can see, there's a little bubble. It's floating. You just want to add more to make some more bubbles. And if you don't, if you wait for them to float down, then they won't like go together. So I'm, I'm too impatient. So. Oh yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna show you in the human demonstration because it looks way cooler. beautiful artwork the most beautiful art I've ever seen seeing I mean seen it's the most beautiful thing in the world <laughs> mom what about me when I was a baby oh sorry Megan but you can't compare to this also during the process since I have so much liquid still you can either use a tiny one like this or my favorite specialty the big one Oh, and just a little tip. Make sure you do it right. Make sure you don't stick the tip of this in the oil and then back into the blue mixture because if you do that, it will start to thicken. Like, let me show you. See in there how it's starting to thicken? I don't know if you can even notice, but right there. It, wait, where is it? Can you see that? Yeah, right there it's starting to jellify. So make sure you do not stick the oil in there or that will happen. So he's life in death, life threatening to the society. So be careful. And now that we're done, look at the beauty. Oh, it tastes like oil. It is so 
beautiful and now we're gonna strain it so that it's not in like this liquid anymore so get a strainer or anything like that or like a spoon with holes okay so here's a, like a spoon with holes so you can either get them out like this and so that it strains or you could use a better thing I think actually forget everything I just said don't use a spoon because it sucks and it takes forever but if you don't have a strainer then I guess you'll just have to be stuck with it. Once you strain it though, you need, and I say, you need to strain it. I mean, once you're done straining it, you need to put water on it. Or it'll taste like butt. It will, okay? You need to rinse it! Yeah, rinse it with water and make sure it's in the strainer or have it inseparable. Rinse it, then strain it again because if you have oil, it will taste like booty hole. And you don't want that. Oh, and to show it correctly, I'm gonna show it in the human world because I'm not racist. Now gently pour the oil. Actually, it's not really coming out yet. Well, the oil is, but see, oh yeah. Oh, look at that, so gentle. Oh yeah. See that jelly? Now you wanna rinse it. Whoa, careful. Rinse, oh yeah. Rinse it off so that you don't have any of that nasty gross crap that tastes terrible. Once it's done taking a shower, you just make sure you put it on a plate or something. And now here's the big bowl of it. So it makes a pretty nice amount, you know. And this is what it looks like separate. And yes, it's my finger. I have fingers, if you didn't know. But yeah, that's what it looks like. It looks beautiful. Oh, delicious. You can also swim in it. But Megan doesn't want me to because she says I have feces on my fur. Anywho, I'm going to taste test it. Oh, yeah. Wait. Where is the explosive flavor of deliciousness? Instead, it just tastes like water and that blue liquid, I mean, whatever juice it's called. This is cabbage, you, used, you just used Gatorade to flavor it. It wasn't a lot. Yeah, mom, you could probably add sugar to it and it'll probably taste better. I mean, it still tastes good, it's just not super, super, super. sugary and sweet, mom. I thought the agar powder was a sugar, but in a fancy word. Isn't it called agar in Spanish for sugar? That's azucar, Mrs. No, it's not! I know my Spanish! No, you evidently don't! Listen, Mrs. Cabbage, you just used Gatorade to flavor it. You're gonna have to use something a bit stronger if you want a more of explosive You know, I'm flavor. done. You can take the rest of the video. But, Mrs. What about you? Enjoy and buy my book. Okay, since my mom just exploded and left, now we can taste test it and tell you how it actually tastes. So here they are on the table. They're not all the same shape, but it doesn't really matter. Now for the test tasting. Don't you mean taste testing? I mean taste testing, sorry, my mom. Remember, I have my mom's genes and brain. It just tastes like Gatorade. Yeah, it tastes pretty good. I don't know what your problem was, but I mean, it just tastes like Gatorade with just maybe not as strong as Gatorade usually Yeah, is, you could probably add sugar. We just didn't want to ruin it for the video. Or like use some like juice, you know, like stronger juice, like maybe Concord grape juice or apple juice or, yeah, you know, whatever only, you want. We only tried it with Gatorade, so we didn't know how well it would work with other juices. We just thought it looked pretty, you know, since it's blue. Blue, yeah. So we hope you try this out. It was actually pretty easy. We hope you enjoy it. Yeah, please like, comment, subscribe for more. Ah. And tell us any other things you would like us to make. Or, or my mom. Oh yeah, make. Mrs. Cabbage. Technically this is her segment, I believe, but... Uh, Excuse me. But, uh, but, uh, but, uh, Anyways, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video, even though it sucked. I know a lot of you guys have been requesting it, so I decided, why not? And it's pretty easy. You just buy the Asian at the Asian store for the agar powder and stuff. Anywho, hope you enjoyed it once again, even though I already said it like once or twice. <sighs> anyway, uh, bye from Mrs. Cabbage Farms, where food is amazing. Right is the ring of words when the right man rings. Hey guys, it's Klein Lee, and this is the aftermath of making the video. <laughs> so yeah, and a lot of you guys have been asking for it, so we decided why not show you how to make a... A garballs. They're actually not that bad to eat. I just would probably... We know Mrs. Sugar. Cabbage wasn't too fond of them, but they actually just taste just like Gatorade, so... Yeah, they're pretty good, actually. But, you know, if you want it to be sweeter, you probably want to put something a bit kinda more like, strong. They're like jelly little things. Yeah, they're kind of more like jelly. They're, they're actually kind of... Like, they remind me of those, like, bobo things. You mean the um uh bo wait the bo 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 b